Hey folks, it's Rithgar here, how you doing? Welcome back to Drain Valley 2. I've had a little bit of a break. I've rested my brain just by wandering the pastures, admiring the cows, and now I'm ready to get back to solving puzzles. You go into the coal. These workers here need to go to... Actually, they... Do they? Five. Yes, I do need five workers to go there. But that's all I need. I don't need any more than five. I need five workers in there. We're making five at the moment in that one in order to get the other five of these. That's all good. Right, you go out. Switch and switch. I also need eight steel slabs in here, which is another couple lots of workers. So we'll send a couple lots of workers over here and then remaining workers I want to be sending down that way. I've got those steel slabs, they're ready and waiting, and do that, do that, send you out, steel slabs, I want five steel slabs back that way, no, send them on out that way, they need to go on round here, go... I'm assuming I need to go into there. I don't think I need to put any more going any other direction. You can go as well. And we'll get ten workers into there. And while we're waiting for ten workers, uh, that one can go out. And that can bring me more material back down to this one. And then I'll send another one out as well. Like that. Now, is that going to work? Yes, that has worked. Right, that's good. Uh, so I got ten lots of those on the way through. I need three to go up there and I need five to come down here. So that's more than enough of them. I need one load of coal to go this way. So I want workers here to go there for the coal. I need a load. I'm going to send coal down that way. No, I'm not. I'm going to send the first load of coal into here. Then I'll send coal down there in a little minute. Send some workers out. I've got everything I need being made over there. I've got all I need being made right there. I still need five of those to be made. And that's what we're going to be using that one for at the end. So I will switch that over. We'll get workers over that way first. We'll send a double lot of those out. Uh, three of those can go out over to there. Need any more than that. You will go through, uh, you switch there, uh, you switch there. So that one goes on round that way. You go back so that we send more workers over there. And then this is going to be the final five, which we're going to need to send down this way. I've got ten workers heading over that way. You switch there, and I'll start sending the coal out. Um, you can switch, you can switch, and... Let's get some of those on their way. There's three of them gone in. I got these. Let's send a couple of these out. Pause that one a minute. Another one of them. And you can go. So there's five of those down there. That's all I'm going to need. You go. Don't crash. Last thing we need is a crash. I've only actually got to have five of them work. We've got power up and running. So I only need five of them to be working. You switch and you go that way. Right round. Uh, switch that one. Switch that one. So you're going to go the way that you need to go. This is going to come in and that's going to make the last few that we need to get delivered over there. Night. Yeah. See, I told you. Not even one. Uh, yeah, I'm, I'm going to at least get one star, but... This, this is ridiculous. I, I, I'm not sure. Uh, maybe you know, upgrading the trains to start with was a little bit of an error. Um, I'm, I will freely admit that I probably got that bit wrong. But my goodness me. I could definitely do better. I could definitely do better than that. Another three star victory. I mean, I'm getting these other two. I'm getting these stars all right. I'm picking those bits up all right. But uh, quite frankly, the others are significantly more difficult. I need to be thinking about the timing of everything and 
Possibly, do I need to be getting the power up and running faster? Is that what I'm doing wrong? Am I waiting too long? Do I need to be upgrading the trains? Like, I upgraded the trains soon, but maybe I shouldn't have done that. Maybe I should have tried to spread the tracks around a little bit faster. I don't know. This is it's getting trickier and trickier. So our next one is called Warden Cliff. Warden Cliff right here. 15 minutes. Do not upgrade engines. Do not allow any train to arrive at the wrong station. Okay. I need power for absolutely everything. Well, not everything. I need power to make those. I need power to make those. I need four of them. I need 12 of them. I need 12 of them. And eight processed rubber. Rubber tree. Processed rubber. That doesn't require any power at all to do that bit. I do require power over here. I need processed rubber and... Oh, I need copper and I need polymers over there to produce wire. Which I need power to do. I got 60 grand to start with. I get copper off of the docks down there. I need copper bars and rubber over here. So I need this to produce wire, and I need to make 12 wire. And I need power over on this side to produce polymers. And I need the polymers over there. So, oh, and I need polymers over that side as well, and I need wire over there. But we need, polymers have got to be the priority, haven't they? So if polymers have got to go first, like, ordinarily, I would sort of lean towards doing these first, but I'm thinking that we need to start getting this going first. So I need to join that together there, but then I also need to be able to get it from over this side. So let's first of all have a look at where we can connect up. Uh, right, well, I can put a tunnel underneath for 62 grand, or I could do one there for 122,000. I can build a bridge across there for 22, there for 12. That side is 17. I'm thinking this side would be better, wouldn't it? Now, can I... I can't go straight up there. That would have... Obviously, that would have been nice and simple then, wouldn't it? That, that would have been wonderfully simple just to build a connection up there, but we can't do that. So we need to build a bridge here to connect that one at 20, at almost 20, and at almost 20, which means that then I'm not going to have enough to be able to join them all together. So we start with the oil, because I've also got to be able to get that one connected in, and that's going to be even more tricky. Where? How do I join there? 40,000 up to there. I can't connect onto the side. Right, I can't go... I can't get up there anyway. So the power station... I can go through there with a tunnel. And then I can go... No. Nope. I can bring a tunnel through there, and I can go round that way, and I can join up there. Which would allow me to get people down through here. Actually, that's all I need to do. So that would be a possibility. And getting the people and the oil up there is as simple as putting bridges over there. So we will go with a bridge there and we will go with a bridge there like that. And we will join those two together. We will join those together like that. That will go straight up there. And join that. Do not allow trains to arrive at the wrong station, that one is, isn't it? And then we will join that one onto there. That's left 17,000. Which is just the right amount of money to build a bridge onto here. Uh, which side? I want to build a bridge on that, so that's 18,000. Because if I go there... Oh no, I can build a bridge onto there. And I can still connect that one up. So we could do it like that. I could build a bridge there, and then that will allow me to join round to this side. But we've still got the issue of getting the power over through here. That's, that's going to take a little bit more. 
Okay. Send you through. Tesla's tower strikes and ruins random sections of your tracks. What? Oh, great. That's... That's a bit much, isn't it? Like, I mean, seriously, it, that's... They really do want to throw in as many difficulties as possible, don't they? Right, we'll join that one in there. I'm going to need to be able to join that together in a minute. So I want to get oil over here. Now, I can send people round. Sending people round is an easy thing to do. And so I want to join there to get oil in there. And I want to join in there to um, get people round to this side. So I've got 4,000. I've got five grand at the moment. And... Now you got people coming through to make that. We're going to have to wait a minute. Right, I'll tell you what. Let's go with the track. And we will go up here. That's, that's where I'm going to want to join in. Okay, so 5,000, I'm up to there. There's a good start. Send more people down through. That'll be another four grand when they get there. As long as enough people have sort of been used up. But there's 4,000 there, so that can go and join in there. So actually, you go that way. I'll send two more going that way. And then switch that one over. You can go around as well. I'll pause that train in just a moment. Right, pause you there. And then... Off you go, and send some more people out. Those people actually will bring them back here into the oil. You go like that, and bring them back there. So, um, the power is going to be relatively easy, I would have thought. we just got to su constantly supply it with people. That's not going to be quite as difficult as I first sort of thought that it might be. The only issue I've got is I've got to build a tunnel through there for 33,000 in order to be able to get that one to work. Or I've got to, well, building a bridge across here is not going to do me any good because I've got nowhere. I've, I'd have to build the tunnel then through there for 60 grand, which I don't have. So we've got to go through this way. We've got to build that one through there. It's the only way that we can go. And then we bring that out round and we join it into this track on here does seem to be the only real way that we can do this and then we got to start joining that in over on this side let's leave that for a minute right so getting the power would be good I don't have to have the power as the next thing because I've got these things sort of joining together I do want to get the power fairly soon, but also we want to start working on some of these. So why don't I use a little bit? We'll, we'll bring that out there like that. Bring you over this way and join you into there. So you can start sending out a few people as well. Just like that. They can go in and... Right, that one's in. I'll switch you over so there's four more oil to go there. I can't send any more oil out round because we've only got a maximum of ten. It would be a complete and total waste. Uh, I... Actually, no. Oh, I've only got seven grand at the moment. Even though I send that, that's, that makes eleven. I can bring the track round so that we can... St I want to get the power going, really, don't I? I can send more people round over to here. There's 8,000. That makes 19. Th no, it's... Um, the tunnel is like... Yeah, the tunnel's 33,000. I don't have the money to build that tunnel yet. Which means that we've got to do this a slightly different way. I've got 17 over to there. No. It needs to go there. Right, 17,000 onto that one. I've got another 8,000 coming in. With employees right here. I've actually got another four going up there. They're all heading back here to the oil. Now keep those running. And that's going to get the polymers. We've got the polymer bit set up over here. I'm three minutes in right now. 6,000 right there. Uh, so I go like that. 
and I go one up there, and one over this way. Right, that's as far as I can go for a minute. I need to get one train in. Let's just do that. There. Right, that's got my next lot. You can come out. Switch that way. And that one's going to go like that and join into there. So I need to send out employees straight over to this side now. Start getting that rubber coming back through. I need tires over there. Uh, we need the rubber in there to make the tires. And I need tires going to that one as well. So let me get another lot of employees going up there. Should take care of that. Uh, another lot of employees coming back through into here. Take care of that. And then the rubber will be going, moving in the right direction. Let's put a few of these through. I'll send some more of them out. Time that one gets up here. Right. I remember it saying about this now. Random sections of track are going to be destroyed. How much is it to... There's 5,000 to repair random sections. If track is damaged, it's five grand to repair it. Right, well, I've got all of this is maxed out. So I don't actually need to repair that track just for a second. Which means that what I can do instead is... Those people can go in there. And I can build that to go that way. And I can send... A rubber train going this way. So that's got me nine grand. Uh, that's got me 8,000 on there. I've got 19 on me at the moment. That's going to bring the tires. So I need tires here. I need tires back here. I've got one damage track there, one damage track there, and one damage track over there. Right. Patch that one. And patch that one there. Because I want to get these tires to come out and send them over this way. Probably be our best bet. Although, before I go being too hasty with that, that's 7,000. Yeah, you're going in there. And then you're going to come out. And come up this way towards the rubber. Go like that. Send you all the way into there. So I've got the rubber going right there. This natural rubber there, that one can come out. And that's going to go into that one. You're going to switch over. Yeah, keep building. Let that train move, and I need to keep building. Right. 12,000 are there. There's another eight grand I can put you into there. Switch you over and go like that. You go this way. Send more rubber into that one. i got to start sending a load of people out. I need to get a load of people over to that one as rapidly as possible. I get the rubber into there. Send another rubber train into there. Let's get all of the rubber into there that we can. Three lots of people going into there be an excellent idea and then i want to get more rubber i want to get more people back here to deal with this but first up no nope, keep going first up let's switch you over and we'll start sending people into there i want to get two lots of people into that one there like that um and then over this side right and now on 31,000, we're closer to being able to use the power. This bit down here, I think, is going to be a later thing to do, but not too much later. Where are we going to bring that? Maybe we're going to bring it across here. I don't really know. I don't know what the best way to go for that one is. Um, right. Well, there's everything in there that I want for a minute. So I got 43 grand. I've got tires and I've got bits up here. I also want to get tires over there. So if I can deliver some tires over that way, just go like this. Yeah, if we destroy some, we destroy some. So you go that way and go that way. Do a connection on both of them. Do the same there. Now I've got all of these tires making. Let's send out some tires. I want to join 
that cross there and switch. So you go that way, you want to go that way, you want to go that way. It's going to send people up there. Well, not people. It's just going to send materials up that way. That would be a good thing. I'll send more materials up that way. So that's the eight tires that I want over that side. As soon as that one's gone through, I'll start sending some more people out down this way. But I need to get these other tracks done. Now, I want tracks over there so that I can send polymers over that way. I'm going to want to send the copper over that way as well. Copper and tires need to go over to this way. So where can we go? I cannot build up that hill. So I can't get up that hill for the tires to come up here. Which means if I'm going to build a bridge, I can do 80,000 for a bridge all the way across there. Or I can do 22,000 for a bridge across there. I'm thinking a bridge across there for tyres would be best. And then we can bring it up here and we can connect it. And we can also use that for delivering the copper pieces as well. So we'll drop that one in there. That's 22,000. Going to have to leave that. I've got two lots of 12,000 heading over that way to be delivered right now. And as soon as they've gone through, send some more of these through like this. I'm going to need 12 tyres up here. Now, I've got 8 tyres in there, so I only need 4 more. I don't need any more anywhere else. That's the, the maximum that I need. So, I don't need to be waiting around for any more than 12 tyres. So, I've got 8. I only need another 4 to be able to get those. It does help, I have found, though, to have a little bit of redundancy in places. So, if I've got just like a little bit spare... A little bit of spare rubber or something like that, just in case of something nasty going on like this. Blowing up the wrong train. Right, there's one there. There's one over there. And there's one right there. Okay. We'll join that back together. Like that. I'll join that back together. Like that. that no nope, that needed to be joined back together as well I'm gonna join that one back together so that one's now connected back up this one is gonna be joined back together right I've repaired all the damage that's been done I've got eight grand left so I'm gonna go that way and I'm gonna join that into there and then I'm gonna bring you over there, so it's got me three grand. And then we're going to go this way, like this. I should be able to bring that up and into there for ten. Right. So I can do that. Uh, 4,000 going up through here. I've delivered all of the tyres that I need to deliver. So i got four grand there to deliver that. And then I've got copper over here. Right, you're in there, you're in there. This is all done over here. I've only got 4,000 and I haven't connected up the power. This is going to be my undoing. I've got 15 minutes altogether. i got to get in... Right. Workers from there into the copper. Workers from there uh, go straight into that one. We'll get a couple train loads of workers going straight into the copper bars. And I need to get the power going next, I think. Um, although I'm not going to be able to do that next. What I've got to do next is I've got to join this up. So I've got 4,000 there. I need to be able to join that one up there. So I'm going to switch that one over like that. You go on there. I'll send rubber through. It's going to get me some money. You will go that way. You will go that way, and I'll go like that. And I've now got that one joined in there. Uh, twelve, Yeah, 12 rubber tires I needed to go into there. So I have no employees that I can send out. So you go that way, and you go that way. So we can send out the rubber tires up to this one. I got more employees going into there. So I can switch that one round like that, and that one round like that. And I'll be able to dispatch the copper in just a minute. I got 21,000. So I've either got to send materials up there. 
or I've got to join this one in. I want to join this one in next so that I can start making the polymers because I've still got quite a lot to do with making those polymers. Uh, send out another thing of rubber. Send out a copper train. That should have the two of them sort of flow past each other quite nicely. I'm hoping. I've got four people up there already. I'll bring out another four people in just a minute. As soon as that rubber train goes past, I'll send another four people out. Like that. Off you go. And then that one can go. That one will come on through. I've only got four of those. Those are in the right place. That's actually all of the rubber that I'm going to need. I'm going to send more of those back over this side so that I've got some spares just in case I need them. You will go now and start going out with some employees up to this one so that we get those running. And I'll get those employees coming through in just a minute. I will send the copper train out. I'll send two of those in quick succession up to here. Now we're talking. I've got 73,000 now. There's another one of those to go up. Right. I'll let that next one come in. Right. Next. I want to build that into there. We've got to get the power station going next. That's got to be the next thing that we do. So we want to join that up this way. I want to get it as close to this side as possible. And it's going to go there like that. So we switch that one over. We switch that one over. And I start sending employees out here. And literally just send employees straight out and ask and start making these. I need four of them over there. And then I need 12 polymers up there. So I need 16 polymers altogether, which means I need eight more oil and eight more people. Both of which I can do. That's not going to be an issue. We can keep the people running over that way. I got all of these that I need. Uh, send some more people down this way. Just so that we've got some spares over there. And actually, no. I'm going to send people over there to the copper. Make sure that I've got plenty of people over there with the copper. You go out. I get more people coming down here for running power. Can't do much with that one yet. That one we'll be doing in a minute. Send you out. Right, there's the power up and running. Which means that we got that one up and running. So there's... Uh, you know what I'm going to do? That one's going to come down there. You're going to switch over and you're going to go over here to polymers and uh, send more of those out. Uh, hello. Now we've got trouble. One over there. One over that side. Oh, one there. That one's a bit of an issue. Right. I got five people in there. I want to join that back together there because it's cheaper if I go round the big hole in the ground. I got people going this way. Actually, that person's gone the wrong way. So, switch back, go that way, go towards the power, head down here. I've got the polymers now, so I'll send polymers out um, while I'm just waiting for that oil to go through. So you're going to go that way, and there, and into there. Right, that's good. Oop, switch that one over. Right, now you, oil, you're going to go out over to here. I'm going to send two lots of oil out from here. Like that. I've got... The power is still running. The power is still going, although I'm not currently making use of it. Which is a very, very bad thing. We want to be making use of this at all times, if at all possible. 13 minutes. I got a minute and a half. No, I got two minutes. Um, I don't have time to do it. Two minutes. I could start moving those. There's only so long that I can continue working through puzzles at any one time before my brain starts to hurt. So we're going to take a little short break from this. If you've enjoyed the episode, then please head down below and give us a like. And if you really enjoyed it, then please tell your friends all about me. Get them to come and watch as well. That would be awesome. And until next time, thank you very much for watching. This is Prithgar. Goodbye and see you later.